while back I found a video in which there appears to be the use of what's called a Tesla howitzer, um, also known as a, a scalar wave uh, weapon, or, or no, a scalar wave howitzer. Um, the foremost expert on the scalar wave howitzer is Thomas Bairden, uh, Bairden uh, who uh, has this to say about uh, the exothermic mode of a Tesla howitzer. Uh, in what is called an exothermic mode, the howitzers can cause a blast of heat at the interference zone, an explosion of near nuclear proportions. It could topple buildings and cause other destruction, or it could be set wide and heat the atmosphere in that region, or it could be set to simply destroy all electronics in that interference target zone, or to destroy the hubs of the electric power grids of a very wide area. Although it seems unbelievable, the actual energy of the blast is not traveling through space to hit the target, but actually being made to emerge from the local vacuum in the interference zone. Uh, that last little bit, uh, it seems to me, is disinformation as what is observed in that video from Iraq of a U.S. soldier uh, using apparently a Tesla howitzer on a mosque. Uh, it shows the energy travel from the howitzer to the mosque. Uh, there is a blue glow uh, before then the mosque is destroyed. And um, I'll go ahead and I'll show you what video it is that I'm talking about. Uh, I had been going through my uh, I had been going through my advanced weapons uh, playlist on YouTube, which is available on my channel, and it had occurred to me that this video was not in there and this is one of the most advanced weapons of all time and so I figured I should almost definitely make sure that I get it in there and so I went looking on YouTube for this video and I could not find it. Uh, so uh, I went out there onto the web and I found a copy of it on Google. Uh, however, I had to create an account on uh, Apache Video website in order to view this video. The video was very low quality. Uh, so I uh, went looking further for it and it took me a little while and finally I found a decent quality uh, version of it on MySpace and uh, the video on MySpace um, it could not be rewound uh, you could not click within the timeline of the video to rewind it to just be uh, just beyond where the blue wave shoots to the mosque it um, it enforced that if you attempted to rewind it to that area of the video, it would jump to just beyond that area, just beyond where the explosion had occurred at the mosque, based on the power wave traveling to the mosque. Um, I don't know, so it was one more way to obscure, you know, beyond not publish the stuff in the major media, uh, it was one more way to obscure the existence of this weapon. Here's a video. Now just before the... just before the blue flash goes from... from the soldiers position to to the mosque he yells fire in the hole which is to say uh, he was aware that there was an explosion about to occur now notice that all the dust jumps off of this building it so shakes the ground that it's all the way down the street that that the the dust jumps in, up into the air. So there is essentially a mini earthquake that occurs all the way down this street. This is apparently a uh, this is apparently a portable version of this weapon, and uh, to my understanding. There are uh, other versions of this weapon, uh, the Scalar Wave uh, Interferon, 
uh, I don't know, whatever they want to call it, um, I don't know, I guess harp is based on this stuff, which uh, essentially they just use, um, they use electromagnetics to create waves in the air, and uh, they are able to cause earthquakes with this technology, uh, they're able to affect weather patterns, um, uh, they could uh, either heat or cool an area. They can cause uh, there to be um, you know, cloudiness or rain uh, based on you know, sending energy to gather um, moisture out of the air. And uh, I don't know, obviously uh, the destructive potential of this weapon is huge. And it's definitely something that people should be aware of that, you know, there are certain obviously uh, hugely psychotic minds that are wielding these weapons and, you know, controlling warfare globally. Um, you know, they, they're able to uh, cause, beyond earthquakes, uh, volcanic activity, stuff like this, shooting uh, energy into the... Uh, the calderas of volcanoes. So uh, this is, uh, is a, it's a technology people should be aware of. So I'm gonna go ahead and post it to my advanced weapons playlist here on YouTube.